Hey guys, what's going on? Hi. Uh, today we're having chicken sandwiches um, and a side. And uh, Jenna will show you the side. But before we get started, guys, you know what to do. Thumbs up this video. Subscribe if you haven't already. And hit that notification bell so you can be notified. Ding. About, uh, our, you know, when we upload. <laughs> yeah. Guys, um... Check out our community board. It's awesome, guys. What we do is we put we post things there. You guys can rate it or comment and all those different things. So make sure you check out our community board. That's that's another way that we can actually get to know you guys. All right? All right, guys. So we have spicy chicken sandwiches. Uh-huh. And um, hold on, hold on. Okay, 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 okay. All right. Uh -huh. We got a spicy chicken mm -hmm. sandwich. Yeah. We mm -hmm. have one with cheese, Gouda uh -huh. cheese. Onions, tomato, Gouda. and lettuce. Yes. We have one on brioche bun, which he's going to go ahead and brioche. show. Go ahead. Okay, okay. Show the one with the cheese. Oh, okay. That one. Okay. All right, this is brioche, guys. Look at that. You want to take the lid off? Okay. Let's see what's underneath the hood, guys. Okay. All right. Let's see. Oh, sorry. A little messy. Uh, <laughs> check this out. Okay. <laughs> we have no, tomatoes, they, cheese. Okay, huh? That's not how you do it. Okay, okay, all right. Let me turn it over. Let me show them this way. Okay. Can you see the side? Oh, uh, no. It's not showing it. You toasted the bun. I'll, I'll let you do it. Okay. Mm. Okay. All right. <laughs> Hold all on, right, guys. guys. This, this piece is of how it right looks. Here. I don't know if you guys can see it, but it was some onions on here. Where are they? The onions on the bottom. Oh, see, what we okay. did was we put the lettuce and tomatoes on the top, and we put onions, fried onions on the bottom. Okay. All right, All right guys. Well, how about this? This is my mm -hmm. sandwich. Can you, well, yeah. you can keep it. And the reason why we did that is because we could, the sandwich would be all over the place. You know, can the onions would be falling out. The yeah, they can see those onions. Okay. Uh, Jenna wanted you to see that because they were nice and fried. And then the tomato. There you mm. go. She so, actually deep fried the onions. Uh huh. What were we saying? So, um, <laughs> we have one on wheat bread and one on brioche. Okay. Andrew will be having the brioche. I will be having the wheat bread. Okay. All right. All right. We check also out the have toast. some. Look at this. Yeah, this I did bread. toast it. Uh huh. We have some broccoli and rice back here, guys. Uh huh. Mm hmm. I'm trying that. to show you guys. Okay. And I put some uh, other stuff in there, y'all. Okay. So we can have some veggies. Yeah. You got to get those veggies in, guys. Yeah. That's important. All, All right. right. Thank you, Lord, for this food that we're about to receive to nourish and strengthen our bodies. In Jesus' name and we pray. pray. Amen. Amen. Yes. So how are you guys doing today? Yes. How are you guys doing? What have you guys have been up to? Um, let's see. I am going to try the one without cheese first. I'm going to save the one with the cheese for last because I love um, Kuda cheese. What are you guys eating for, de for dinner? Oh, I forgot to tell you guys. This is spicy. Yeah, what are you eating for dinner? Let us know. This is we spicy. We got our green juice back here. He was really supposed to offer you guys the first bite. <laughs> I'm sorry, guys. Where my manners? There y'all go. A little mm -hmm. chicken patty. It's spicy, too, guys. Is it real mm -hmm. spicy? No. It's like a, a hint of spice. It's subtle. It may sneak up on me a little more later. Okay. All right. <laughs> what? Can we get okay. a bite, please? My Lord. This plate is bigger than you are, Jenna. Look at that. You're like peeping over the plate. <laughs> okay. Man, look at the mayonnaise on this. We were not playing. Look at that, guys. I wish you guys could. Mm. He dropped the onion, y'all. I don't let onions go. Mm -hmm. You love onions. I do. All right, guys. We're going to talk today about... The fear of eating in public restaurants. Well, hmm. not fear, but our mm -hmm. experiences. Our experiences, uh-huh. Look, your sandwich cannot compete with my sandwich. Look at this. Look at that cheese. Look at that. That's 
my sandwich. When we were younger, we mm -hmm. used to always go out, you know, for a treat. Mm-hmm. We did. We've been to several restaurants. You want some? Yes, thank you. Thank you. You gotta wipe your hand. Okay. When did we um okay. when did we stop eating at like restaurants really? Wow. You know what? I, I <laughs> Jenna, what's going on? We struggling, y'all. We struggling. We at work. <laughs> what's going on, Jenna? I'm t you gotta eat. Look at this. Look at this. You I'm on the edge. Eat. Look at this. You have to eat. <laughs> okay. <laughs> we on here to give them a show, not just sit here and act like we not on camera. Eat. Mmm. <laughs> we put some more flavors in this. Hmm. This is good. Mm-hmm. This tastes different than what I tasted before. When did we stop going to restaurants? Um, if there's a writer that would like to write our dialogue in our shows, please email us. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we don't write nothing. Off the top of the head, guys. We're really off the top of the mm. head. But when did we stop going to restaurants? Well, I used to love seafood, right? Um, crab cakes. You know what, Jenna? <laughs> I was eating some of that. You okay, are all right. Tall. Okay, okay, all right. Go, go ahead. I'm, I'm gonna talk. Okay. Okay, eat, eat a piece of sandwich. <sighs> Let's see. Mm. Everybody doing challenges on YouTube. We should have a challenge. Mm hmm. This sandwich is good. Okay. You gonna drop that onion? Mm. You gonna drop the onion? I can't afford to drop any more onions. He's gonna take them. Okay, go ahead. Okay. This sandwich is good, y'all. It really is. Go ahead. Mm. We were waiting. A fried chicken sandwich. <laughs> it's battered too, guys. Did we show up that it's battered? Babe, can we okay. get through to this okay. conversation? All right. I used to like seafood, right? Oh, and so, yeah. yeah, I used to um, like crab cakes, shrimp, crab legs, lobster, all those different things. And I used to go to restaurants to get those things. And, um, well... And then we also used to go to buffets. Well, we went to a buffet. Uh huh. We I'll say this. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we yeah we went to buffets, and um, thank you. Um, at a buffet, well, it's all mouth. you can eat. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Is it gone? Mm -mm. Yeah. Mm -mm. Okay, it's gone. Okay. Um, the buffet is all you can eat, right? So, um, I literally. Ate as much as I could possibly eat. <laughs> it was terrible. Bad choice. Yeah. And we didn't have a car, right? I hate to um to tell you the whole story, but Well uh, tell it, but this is a food channel. Okay, okay. All right. Well, yeah, and they had all types of things like fried shrimp, battered fried shrimp, they had scallops, they had um what else did they had? Um, it was like a Chinese buffet, right? Yeah. Yeah, and it had like green. It was also we went to a um, place mm -hmm. where, like, it was like a diner where they're out all you know, mm -hmm. you know open all night. Go ahead. All you can eat. Um, yeah, a diner that's yeah, all mm -hmm. yeah, like she said. <laughs> it is not all you can eat at a diner. No, it's not. Well, anyway, the diner was served seafood, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, that was the one I was talking about. Anyway. Um, I got sick after the diner, and yeah, um, he had sea, he had seafood like a crab cake. A crab cake, guys, I love this crab cakes. This had to be mm -hmm. about at least twelve years ago. I used to. Hmm? No, maybe more. Yes, it was a long time ago. But anywho, mm -hmm. he had a crab cake, mm -hmm. and then he unfortunately he got sick after that crab. Cake. I got sick. Yeah. So he never had crab cakes out ever anymore. again. Yeah. Um. Mm. Oh. Remember when we went to that mm -hmm. during, we went mm -hmm. to this place that's no longer open. I think they mm -hmm. will had a little problems, mm -hmm. if you understand what I'm saying. Oh, yeah. You mean the food, excuse me, the food boy you came okay? for him. Mm-hmm. Sorry, I almost, <laughs> almost went down the, the wrong pipe. Mm-mm, mm the food boy. I'm not talking about that. Oh, okay. Not that one. Okay. So we went to this diner, right? Mm -hmm. We went to mm -hmm. this restaurant, mm -hmm. and it was dark. Now we go to dark restaurants. Mm-hmm. Right. Do y'all know? 
that's back when I was eating, drinking soda. So this had to be over 16. Years. Oh, I know exactly the one you were talking about. I mm -hmm. know we were dating or married. <sighs> or a little bit of both. We were married. But anywho, we were married. Mm -hmm. Do y'all know that I looked at my darn glass and it was a napkin inside? And I, that's back when my temper was horrible. I refused. I don't think we ate anything because I, that was back in my day where if I didn't like your service, I would walk out. Mm hmm. Yeah. yeah. Didn't matter what point. No, time we, no, we had to pay. Service was. We had to pay. Oh. No, we had to pay. I remember. We ain't had to pay. He was goody two shoes and paid because I wasn't going to No, pay. no, no. Pay. You were treating me because I ain't paid. Yeah, because they, they, no, no. I think we threw them. The, what did he do? I threw the money at him. Yeah, I remember. <laughs> Cause I say, oh, this is dirty. You put a whole yeah. thing in there. They didn't Thank want God to... I didn't drink out of it. I never did drink out of it. Yeah. Did I drink out of it? I might have drank a little bit. Unfortunately, it had a napkin in it. It had a whole and it, it was, was a dirty cup. Yeah, the restaurant was dark, so we couldn't tell. Mm -hmm. And by the time we realized, it was too late. It was terrible. And then we tried to complain to the manager. And the manager didn't. He was. He was. Mean. He was not nice. Yeah. He was. Mean. And and basically made us pay for it, right? It made wasn't. Us a, pay for it. Yeah. You know, when I threw the money on the ground and yeah, left. And we left. Mm -hmm. uh, so, that's. I mean, that was one horror story. Yeah. Fortunately, we had we, cash. Uh huh. Yeah, we yeah. did have cash. Yeah. Yeah. We just haven't had good luck with restaurants. Luck with restaurants. Uh -huh. And then now mm -hmm. that social media is prevalent and they're actually showing you guys, mm. showing us mm. the horrible things that people are doing to people's food. Now, I'm glad that we said this because mm -hmm. now mm -hmm. we're going to the respect. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Why do you think that the fast food workers and the, and the restaurant workers are so mean and apprehensive to the customers? Let's talk about it. Before I do that, let me take another bite of the sandwich. Mm. 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 Y'all leave it up in the comments. That's a good. That's Shout a good out sandwich. to Miss Ingrid. I'll be reading all your comments. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's one of our foodie fam. Hey, what's going on, fam? <laughs> she said her last comment, because the one with the bonnet, she said, mm -hmm. honey, I don't judge nobody. Yeah. Honey. If it don't pertain to me, it's not I don't important. care about it. It's not yeah. important. Yeah. <laughs> I feel you, darling. I do. Yeah. Um, oh, yeah. Why well, do, why do mm -hmm. people, why are these workers so mean to the customer? Why are they doing such derogatory things to the food? Go ahead. Okay. Well, number one, it's a highly stressed job. If you guys have ever worked right. in fast food, you'll know it's a highly stressed job. You get the stress from the management. Hey! Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> hold on, let me hold on to my sandwich. Okay. <laughs> I mean, it's just sitting there. <laughs> All, right, go ahead. All right. You get the stress from management as well as the as the uh, the uh, customers, right? Mm -hmm. So you know, that's number one. Mm -hmm. It's a service business. Okay, so let's talk about the customers, right? It's a service business. A customer feels like when they go to an establishment that they're going to be served, right? Mm -hmm. And um, they can pretty much say whatever they want to say. Right. And, um, you know, the people who work there don't feel the same way. You know, people have, you know, they're people. They need respect. Um, I'm going to keep it real with you guys. Mm -hmm. I used to didn't tip. Mm -hmm. I was young and dumb. Mm -hmm. I did not tip. And I told you to tip. Until mm -hmm. I got into the hair business. Mm -hmm. Once I got into the hair business, I tip, but I'm gonna let mm. y'all know now. When I order food off Grubhub, shout out to Grubhub. Because we spend a lot of mm -hmm. money on Grubhub on the weekends. Look, like, I take off. We love Grubhub. Mm -hmm. When that darn bill is thirty something dollars, I can't swing another thing, and I feel so bad about that, y'all. I don't tip Grubhub. Mm -mm. But that's not what I was trying to say. This lady, <laughs> we went to Fridays one day, mm -hmm. and she gave us all this service, and then we look. We used to have this little code. If 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 the person didn't give good service, mm -hmm. oh, I'd be like, babe, we ain't, she ain't getting no tip. We ain't, we ain't bad, and it no. worked up until this time. <laughs> this lady or Listen man, up, I think it was uh -huh. a man. He real he followed <laughs> us to the door when we was about to leave, and he was like, "Excuse me, you ain't gonna give me no tip." It's like, oh my gosh, she he demanded. A, he demanded a tip. Yeah, I kept it moving, but <laughs> I was like, oh my gosh. <laughs> 
So ever yeah. since then, when I go in person, we do tip at least a dollar. Mm. So well, at least he talks. If you are a like, part mm -hmm. of the waitress staff, I, I get it. Mm -hmm. I, I, I service do, and industry and in general. Mm -hmm. I yeah. respect you guys when I do go, and, and that's why I don't go out to public mm -hmm. restaurants anymore. Cause honey, sometimes it's too expensive, and y'all be having some damn. Y'all be having some darn bad attitude. Mm -hmm. Y'all take forever, mm -hmm. and I ain't tipping you, baby. I'm not. I tip. Because remember, a tip, one of my clients used to tell me this. A tip is an extra thank you. It is. A tip is an extra and thank you. And most of the like places them. now have gratuity. Mm, so like they demand you automatically it. going to have some type of tip. I hope y'all get a percentage of that gratuity. Please let us know how that works. Because Andrew, he was cheap back in the day. He... <laughs> But you know the tips. We you know now that we mm -hmm. in the hair business back and you know hair business, mm -hmm. they always tip five dollars. You know. Mhm. Mm I forgot. I forgot to tell you that they're tired too. That's mm -hmm. another reason why they have bad attitudes. They what? They're tired. You stand they're not up. Uh huh. Go ahead. You stand up on your feet all day. You're tired. Mhm. Mm oh. And they're dealing with mean people all day. Yes, that's the customer and management well, we may too. We not tip mm -hmm. as good as we should. However, yeah. we're not mean. No. I say please. And I think thank that's you. the most stupidest mm -hmm. thing you can do is be mean. We was at another restaurant. For us to say we don't really <laughs> eat at restaurants, we got a lot of stories. Uh -huh. We used to. Yes, we did. Uh -huh. Every holiday, every anniversary, mm -hmm. yes. Fridays, whatever, yes. uh -huh. we, would, we would go out. But then yeah. things change when, you know. But anyway, we went to this other restaurant. Mm -hmm. And this was with people behind us. So I couldn't really see them. But one of them was a pastor. Oh, tell it, tell it. Uh huh. He was talking to this girl so bad. I was looking at my, I was like, I was looking at Andrew, like, oh my lord, is he really talking to her like that? And then expect her to come and serve. Look, at, we we heard the the end of the conversation. We did uh -huh. end of the service. He was like, oh. No, you just give me the darn take-home boxes, and mm -hmm. I'll make my food out here. I ain't giving you my food. Why do you think he said that? Because well, he just knew mm -hmm. that she was going to do something to his food because mm -hmm. the way he was treating The way he was treating her. Uh -huh. That's no. what. Mm -hmm. She could still do, do you know, something she could. to them darn take-home boxes. She could. They could be all on the floor. You, that's one thing mm -hmm. you don't do. Don't be mean to anybody giving you a personal service, no. whether it be food or no. hair. Exactly, yeah. Yeah, always be nice. Say please, thank you. You know, respectful. These are people. You know, everyone's real. Oh, and another thing, I think you were about to say this, mm -hmm. is they don't train them either, right? Mm -hmm. They don't train them in hospitality no. per se. Mm -mm. Yeah, not all of them. In manners. You? Oh yeah, most. Oh, I know I'm sorry, like guys. I'm sorry, guys. Let's get started. Look at that, guys. Make sure you get a bite right now. Okay. Well, they gotta have the prop. You know, y'all, this is the prop. I won't be eating it. That's Jen, Jenna's uh, sandwich, and this one's mine, okay? That's the prop. All right. Look he probably nice... won't eat that whole thing, but he is gonna take a bite, right, baby? Yeah, I'm definitely gonna take a bite. Look at the, the nice toasted bun. Look at that, guys. But All yeah, right, be here. nice to people. Yes. Be nice to people, because you never know. It smells good. Mm hmm. Huh? It smells good. Oh, okay. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. You never know. Well, you may see that person again. You never know. Isn't that common sense? Mm, mm hmm. I think so. I think so. Why are you covering your mouth? I wanted to make sure my mouth was clean. Mm. Oh. Mm. See? This is a food channel. They want to see you get sloppy whoppy mm. up in here. <laughs> sloppy whoppy <laughs> up in this piece. Mm. You feel me? Who cares yeah. about. That big bite. It being a little messy. Big bite. Look at the nice. This is white meat, guys. I wasn't supposed to eat that whole sandwich, but it was really good. Mm. And this is only our second meal of the day. Right? Mm -hmm. We actually try to um, eat our actual meals. Shout out to all them people stuffing mm. themselves all day to make these videos. We won't be doing that. Mm. Mm -mm. So when y'all see us eating, sometimes we will be a little extra hungry. Why? Because this is actually our meal. Like, we don't mm -hmm. eat extra. Mm -mm. Like, this counts as a meal. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So when it's time for us to eat, we say, okay, let's share this with everybody. And we start yeah. recording. Jenna, it tastes way better with the cheese. 
I'm sure it does. That spice and then that cheese. This is Gouda cheese, guys. This is Gouda. It's just so, it's nice and creamy, you know? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Let's move that rice out the way. <laughs> this chicken sandwich was the, was the <laughs> star. It really was, uh-huh. Somebody don't want to see that rice. Mmm. <laughs> <laughs> But I tell y'all, mm. this is our extra meal, so you know every meal is supposed to have some type of vegetable, you mm -hmm, know? Mm -hmm. Just keeping it all the way 100. All right, hold on. How's my face? Thank you. Stop oh. doing that. Well, I, didn't see the, <laughs> I didn't see the other side. Mm. That was really good, though. Know? How often mm. do y'all eat at uh, public establishments? And shout out to mm -hmm. Grubhub. I, I don't, I don't, they I bring like, food right to you. I love mm -hmm. Grubhub. I really do. I used to, I never used DoorDash. Mm -hmm. I never use Uber Eats. But I do love Grubhub. We do. And once I like a company, I stick with them. I don't just... <laughs> Go to the different You know ones, what yeah. I mean? Mm -hmm. And I love it today because we, we, we are super orderers. We've been ordering since 2004. 2004? Back when... Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's Back when you had menus and you had to order and call on the phone and yeah, you guys remember that the menus that come to your door, like they, the, you know, they had the little people, the delivery people, or the marketers that would go around and put the flyers in your yeah. banister, yeah. Your mailbox, whatever. Go and ahead. I, I hmm. love the fact now that you had reviews. Oh. And so, mm -hmm. this is what I do. I read the reviews. I do. Mm -hmm. I because look. Yeah, you got all these restaurants at the palm of your hand. Mm -hmm. But at the end of the day, I like to see how other people's experiences are. I mm -hmm. read the five-star reviews, and I read the, the, the bad reviews, too. She does. Okay, that's the safe part. Okay, so even if it has four stars, you still read the bad reviews and see how bad it is. And most of the time, the places that I, I order from, the only bad thing is time. Mm. They, they, they may be a little late with their uh, arrival, but it's really, really convenient. I like the fact that, um, oh, the rule to that is the mm -hmm. same. Once you have a good place to that you know the food is good, stick with it. Mm-hmm, exactly. That's, that's huh? how you know that, that's how you, you know, if, if you don't feel well, you know what you ordered. Oh, yeah. And some people just, they eat, they have dinner at anybody's house, they eat at any restaurant. Like, if you go to a McDonald's, the, that McDonald's that you like, you stick to that McDonald's. That way you know. You'll just be eating everywhere. Where you got sick from. Mm hmm Yeah. That's true. Or well, not just where you got sick, but you know they got good service. Oh, that's true. Okay. You know? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That's the key. Like, these sandwiches right here? Yeah. Mm-hmm. They great eh? Yes, they are. <laughs> I, you know, I'm not supposed to eat all this, but... Guys, thank y'all so much. I'm almost done. Mm-hmm. Thank y'all so much for mm. watching, y'all. Mm -hmm. Show them that, 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 that nice little crisp. Mm. Guys, all I did with these brioche buns is I bought some brioche buns, mm -hmm. and I ain't put no butter or nothing on it because I already had it on there. Mm. Put it in the it's toaster, mm -hmm. and there you go. You got some nice toasted brioche buns. Don't be eating them buns straight out the pack. Mm. People oh, eat yeah. Hawaiian rolls and all that straight out the pack, that gooey stuff. Plus, you want to kill some of the germs. You get what mm -hmm. I'm saying? Yeah. You know what I mean? Make it crispy. Make it feel like it's at a restaurant. Like I still We dropping wanna... some knowledge on you guys. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah. And we supposed to make these videos under 25 minutes. So thank you so much. All right. Guys, make sure you thumbs up this video. If you haven't already, make sure you subscribe to our channel and comment so we can get to know you guys. And it's been fun, right? It's been real fun. We'll see you on the next video. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.